How's it going, everyone? I've kind of been gone. Uh, I lost a loved one, and I had to go to a funeral, and then I got sick at the hotel that I stayed at. So, uh, anyway, I'm back, and um, I'm using a selfie stick that uh, I found around the house, and uh, so it'll probably be shaky as hell. Um, so this video is about um, my wife decided to get me a uh, gun. I was going to just get an M&P 45C. And uh, the gun store, they were douchebags. They said it would come down a lot. And it was a $600 price tag. And uh, all they'd come down was $50. And I was like, oh, okay. I don't know if the uh, little guy that ran a store really thought I just had to have it or he thought I was a dumbass and didn't know you can get M&P's for $379 plus a $50 rebate at uh, Quantico Tactical. Um, so anyway, so now I ended up getting a PAP pistol and uh, I... <laughs> I never thought about getting one. Um, I always liked watching, you know, people shooting them and everything. But uh, I got one with a uh, with the SV forty seven brace. That's if you don't know what that is, it's the what they call the Sig brace that uh, dumbasses would write letters to the ATF asking for a permission slip, pretty much when they came with the uh, ATF slip with them. So uh, they came. With that for uh, four ninety nine, and thirty dollars shipping fee. So, uh, so I got a seven six two by thirty nine pat pistol with the with the brace, and uh, it's called the M ninety two. So that's on the way, and um, to my dealer, and so I'm pretty excited about that. Um, uh, but I was telling people, you know. Um, I think that's actually the best deal right now for um, for getting into a rifle, pretty much. Even though they call them pistols. For a defensive carving out to about 300 yards, I mean, really they're more 200, but they, they can be taken out to 300 yards. Um, I think that's an excellent bargain. For the price I've seen them for in the four hundred dollar low four hundred dollar range just a few months ago. <coughs> Here I am still sick. <clears throat> um, I've seen them in the lower four hundred dollar range, and uh, I, I think that's a hell of a bargain for what they are. Um, and with with the seven sixty by thirty nine with the uh, com block cartridge. You lose the way the 762 by 39 is. It's a perfect candidate for um, for short barreled rifles. When I did some research on it, you only lose, I believe, 35. Really, it's like 37.5 feet per inch, give or take, um, that you lose per inch from um, going below 16 inches. So at about 2,350 feet, that you get from a 16 point whatever. Um, regular AK barrel you'll still be getting at least 2100 feet with a 10 inch pap pistol um barrel length um i've read 10 and then i've also read 10.5 but another good thing about it is they are the politically incorrect um weapon they were actually the century pap pistol one of them was at least um recently used in Paris by the ISIS dudes. I mean, that's not why I want wanted to get one, but for whatever reason, the government hates, they absolutely hate the AR and AK pistols. And uh, why not get one just for that in itself? And uh, I mean, that's probably the most politically incorrect weapon you can buy. And it's also at a good price. It's like, I would consider it almost like the uh, Tech 9 of our day and time. It's really cheap and a lot of people have them. Um, and they work pretty good. They have a solid reputation. So I've seen a lot of good reviews on, you know, online and everything. 
over the years, and uh, it was always interesting to watch the fireballs. So I'm, I'll probably get the four-piece um, Bulgarian. I'll probably get the U.S. made one to save money. The flash hider that does a very good job. It also acts as a booster. Um, I'll probably get one of those, and uh, I'll probably just keep the SP-47 brake on it since I um, go to New Mexico like all the damn time to shoot. Um, I actually go to New Mexico more than east side of El Paso. So uh, I really think even in a 5.56 version, they come with uh, they come with a lot of times with the mag adapter to take the regular AR mags. I really think it's a hell of a bargain, even with the uh, short barrel length and everything. Supposedly they work pretty well, but uh, I only stock two rifle calibers now, the 762 by 39 and 54. And for me, it was just a good deal and a um, good thing to add to my collection to complement Skittles, my underfolder. But for the price, you know, I think it's the best deal to get into a uh, defensive weapon, you know, besides a handgun. And I really think because they're the most politically incorrect weapon right now, um, why not? So I hope I made my case. They also should make the perfect um close quarters combat weapon, really, especially if you had a full auto um, short barreled rifle. That'd be absolutely badass. 5.56 five, or 7.62 by 39. I chose a 7.62 by 39 because I like that deep penetration. I'm just messing with you. This is Sly Tiger. Thanks for watching. Take care.